if you check your project folder you see there templates folder uh, that was appeared after installing twig, twig bundle component and um, there is base.html.twig file inside it let's open it it looks like simple html file but with some difference for example this syntax with percent symbols used to run some logic for example if condition or for loop this syntax uh, with hash symbols used to add comments to the template actually these comments are not included in the rendered page uh, and this syntax with double curly braces used to display the content of a variable or the result of evaluating an expression. As for base.html.twig file, it's needed in the concept of template inheritance. It defines the common elements of all application templates such as header, footer and so on. More about template inheritance I'll tell later in the video. Unlike HTML, you can't run PHP code inside Twig templates, but you can use utilities provided by Twig and run some logic in the templates. Let's open Twig documentation and try something of that. To match the URL with the Twig template, we need to create a controller and an action in it. A link to a detailed video on how to render Twig templates from a controller will now appear in the top right corner. this construction in your template, then all this text will be displayed on the page in uppercase. Also, as you can see, there are a lot of block tags in our base template. They are used for inheritance. And we move on. I hope you enjoy this video and see you next time.